ATR accessories may be categorized as single or multiple reflection. As the name implies, a single reflection ATR reflects only once. For a multi-reflection ATR crystal, the IR beam internally reflects along the length of the crystal. The number of reflections is a function of the angle of incidence and crystal thickness and length. It's easily calculated using Pike's FTIR calculator found on the home page of our website. As a quick example, the number of reflections for an 80 by 10 by 4 millimeter germanium ATR crystal is 10. When there is perfect contact between the sample and the ATR crystal, increasing the number of reflections will amplify the magnitude of the absorbance bands. Let's compare spectra collected with Pike's HATR10 and 20 reflection zinc selenide plates. The sample is 70% isopropyl alcohol. The absorbance bands increase by a factor of 2 when doubling the number of reflections. The enhanced sensitivity makes a multiple reflection accessory ideal for measuring samples when the component of interest is low. The figure shown here illustrates the spectral differences found in measuring carbohydrates in soda. Carbohydrates in the sample are nearly undetectable using the single reflection ATR, whereas the bands are accentuated by increasing the number of reflections to 10. For hard solids and powders, typically a single reflection ATR with a small sampling surface area results in stronger absorbance bands compared to a multiple reflection ATR because greater pressure may be applied. Recall, pressure equals force divided by area, producing better contact. To illustrate, these are spectra of a powder collected using the Pike Miracle and HATR. Despite the 10 reflections of the HATR accessory, the magnitude of the absorbance bands is significantly weaker when compared to a single reflection ATR. Should you have questions about this video note, or your own application, or would like to suggest a video topic, please contact us.